we are just look at that. Oh, squint in right away. Oh, geez, oh, that's too much. It's too much. It's too much. I can't take it. Uh, she's singing away quite nicely. It's quite noisy once she gets going. 3.3 kilowatts going in. <laughs> much, much needed. Much, much needed because as of this morning, we were down to 33%. Um, so there's a much, much needed wee dollop going in. That's the little car, of crappy things up off the deck. Ready to break down and get cracking because I'm running out of excuses now. Um, I've had a delivery from RS Components which will be itty bitty teeny weeny oh no it will be itty bitty teeny weeny little ring terminal um come on Itsy bitsy teeny weeny ring terminals for balance leads for the bloody VMSy thing. Um, so, oh, I've just broken the gimbal mount. <clears throat> so, itty bitty itsy teeny weeny ones. Job I'm not looking forward to. So, I could break this down a little bit, take all the balance leads off and things like that. I might leave the old dally there because it gives me something to zip tie the JK BMS to um, and as a mount so yeah I'm full of fear and trepidation because there's so many leads there's so many leads in the JK BMS that I'm just like well what the bloody hell does this one do um, but hopefully all will become clear And there it was gone. So at least it gives, at least, at least she shut up and it gives us uh, peace and quiet. As I said, there's so many bloody, there's so many leads and God knows what. Uh, it, uh, it, the wee circuit board that feels like it will snap if you look at it the wrong way. Balance leads, which is self-explanatory enough. Um, maybe. Box of other... Box of other leads with pluggy things and whatever. Um, so I need to try and figure out what that is. Bloody wee red one there. I need to try and figure out what that one is. On off switch is probably self explanatory enough, but then you've got this little jobby that you've got all of those connected into one, and then a red and a black one, very, very skinny, very, very tiny, so they don't take bugger all power. So it's just like, well. WTF does this one do? I really, really do not know. Um, so there's going to be plenty of plenty of visits back to Andy's off grid garage and be like, oh, help, I'm stuck again. First things first is to break this down, take off some cabley wabblies, and uh, give it the old Mark One eyeball and crimp balance leads with these tiny little buggers. Honestly, the shipping was the shipping was more than the uh, 
the shipping was more than the parts. But the reason why I went back to RS components is it takes a nice teeny tiny skinny wire, but it's got got a nice bit of meat on it. That's the same diameter as the stud nuts on the batteries, so you get a nice good contact area. So that's the reason why I went for those ones from RS components instead of scammers and they're all really really expensive to be honest with you which is all a bit shit so onwards and upwards right then i am supposing that uh it might be a good idea just to check that the old dilly dally's turned off uh it's uh however much that is voltage wise and stuff like that but, but, but uh Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just going in. Oh, cancel. And you. Just going in. So that should be that. Oh, interrupted by a phone call. Hold the line caller. Oh, Charlie, it's been fun. You will get to ride again, dear friend. Oh, fuck. Oh, these clips are horrible. Well, I'm going to say that's not coming out in a hurry. Uh, oh, bloody bugger. Oh, bloody bugger. Right. It's going to have to stay attached, I think. Oh, that was fucking brutal. Excuse my language. Keep on getting told off. <laughs> The good wee thing that was is it should get you should get used again. It should get used again. And unbelievably, I've still got the box. Not even going to attempt to pull the Bluetooth out, otherwise it will end up in tears. And I reckon my screen's just funked up. There we go. I'll go in. Thank you very much. Put you over there for safekeeping.
Right, anyway, well, you catch him adrift. I shall be a while. And you don't want to listen to this screaming its head off all the time. 3.1 kilowatts. Whee Three point five we and we are up to forty two <laughs> forty two Everybody's looking for the meaning of life and everything. I would just like to say that I'm bored already and quite emotional. But it's really quite cool that I've got the tumble dryer running and I'm still charging the batteries. Ah, <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner. And she is naked and ready to go. So, uh, right. Here we go, no use prevaricating about the bush. I need to go and crimp some balance leads. Because inconveniently, all the plugs are different to the dally. On this JK BMS, we've got four little itty bitty plugs, which is gonna be amusing. Ah, look at this shit, back on form. Absolutely hoofing it down. Yucky. But it is now gone dinner time, just been feeding our face and so quarter past seven. There's not gonna be any more power really coming in. Well a couple of hundred watts. So it's covering its consumption, which is good. So I started the day about 35% on this bank and we got up to 58. That includes running the wash machine and doing a little bit of cooking with it as well. But interestingly, actually is something of interest for once on my channel. The right bank is up to 69%. Now, oh, I'll turn on battery saver. Um, the old phone battery is going to die. Ha ha ha. This phone, not this phone. So with life at 30% to 50% constantly over a period of time, my left bank and my right bank deviate slightly on the um, overall percentage sort of thing. Um, and also sort of during discharge that one seems to discharge quicker than that one and during charge that one seems to charge quicker than that one so it's all a bit weird but it sorts themselves as soon as they get in the higher state of charge it all equals out and balances out so i don't really quite know what's going on with that i had an old clamp meter on on the power cables and the, you know the jk bms is a reading near enough near enough um so, yeah, it's a good day for the generation, to be honest with you. Good day for charging the battery back up. Try and stop the rot a little bit. Uh, managed to get that stripped down, and I'm about halfway through crimping balance leads. So that'll be about all I've got.